Well, hello, everybody. It's... It's been a week. It's been a week since I've seen all of you. How are you? Welcome to the Yisbert Games channel. My name is Jacob Burgess. I'm the host of this here channel. Well, I'm one of the hosts of this here channel. Uh, yes, the other would be Meredith Gerber, our social media manager. Uh, but um, uh, tonight, we have something special for you. Something special for you all. Oh, yes. Tonight, we're playing Bloodborne. We're going over, uh, we're going after uh, Ludwig, uh, who is who is a horse, horse, man, horse. Uh, he's just a mess, a mess of body parts and equine rage. Two community members are here, who have been uh, as part of the rest of you chat, uh, helping to guide through the game uh, to extract all of the goodness that can possibly be extracted out of such a horrible, amazing, wonderful game. Uh, we have the Zero to Hero, Jason, and Vinny Fives. Matt, say hello, you two. Hello. Hello there. Yeah. So, what's going to be happening tonight is this boss has uh, uh, whooped up on me for two streams now. Uh, last stream was only horse. It was only horse. I, I, I had dreams for two nights about this boss. Uh, last week, we were on hiatus. I still had dreams about this horse. <laughs> this is a terrible, terrible boss. Um, so the Vinny Fives and the Zero to Hero, who have been wonderful, wonderful guides, uh, along with other folks in chat, uh, came up with the idea and went through and did all of the logistics on their own and said, hey, how about we roll in there with you? And whoop up on this horse. Uh, Yo, we got a hit squad. <laughs> Which is great. Uh, because uh, this game has been very mean to me. And we're going to be mean right back. Um, I will take every advantage possible uh, to get past this. Uh, wouldn't you agree, gentlemen? Absolutely. Yes, I would. Fantastic. Awesome. So, before we get into uh, into everything, allow me to remind you some of the things that Gizbird Games is up to. And if you are new, and you were just brought in by the Bloodborne tag because you can't get enough of this goddamn game, let me welcome you and tell you that Gizbird Games, this channel right here, we're an indie game publisher. And we publish a lot of really cool stuff. You can check us out at gizbird.net. Uh, games such as Valhalla, Cyberpunk Part Dender Action, a beautiful, beautiful visual novel, and the sequel to be coming out, uh, Nirvana, a Cyberpunk Bartender Action, uh, the upcoming game No Place for Bravery, uh, which was just recently given a release window and has some amazing music, which you can find on Spotify. You can find a couple of the trailer tracks there, or you can go to our YouTube channel, uh, youtube.com backslash games and check out the trailer. Two trailers. All the trailers. Just check out the trailers. We got good shit. Um, and along with that good shit, is discounted good shit because there's a number of sales going on one let me just double check and make sure i got all the dates right here he said clicking on his notes <laughs> Boop. uh currently uh the steam summer sale is still rolling on and we'll be doing so until july 8th at 10 a.m pacific uh valhalla masquerada Y2K, a postmodern RPG, and she remembered Caterpillars are all on a fairly significant discount. So please check that out. And also, Humble Bundle is running a DRM Freedom Sale uh, with up to 90% off a ton, a ton of friggin' games. And Valhalla's in there at a third 3% discount. So if you like your games DRM free, you go to Humble. If you don't, and you just want all your stuff in one place, because almost everybody uses Steam, it's, it's ubiquitous. It is a ubiquitous juggernaut. Uh, you can head over there. And that's what we got going on. And I hope you're all doing well. Uh, Jason, Matt, how are you feeling tonight? I'm doing pretty good. It, weather's good. Day's good. That's good. Yeah, basically same. Ready to smash a horse. Uh, yes, absolutely ready to smash a horse. Now, I had a couple of questions for you, uh, for you gentlemen. Um, one, would you like to introduce yourself uh, to the community? Matt, if you'd be so kind as to, to go first. Sure. People that may not know so you. Yeah. Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Matt. Uh, if you're on the Eastbrook Discord, you would have seen me around as Vinny Fives. I pop up here and there. And uh, I've just been hanging out, um, thoroughly enjoying participating in the Bloodborne streams with everybody and 
uh, on the big old virtual couch in chat. And um, I'm happy to be here. Excellent. Very happy to have you. Uh, before we uh, continue on to Jason, uh, Velbastet has subscribed and has done so for six months. Much obliged. And thank you for the support. Uh, Jason. Uh, my name is Jason. I go by either Zero to Hero or I am No Lionheart in the chat and in the eSpread Discord. I've done a little bit of um, graphic design work and emote work for the eSpread Discord. And you can find my stuff at Twitter, on Twitter, at I am No Lionheart. Um, and it's a pleasure to be here. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Uh, oh, and you've had. Um, are you still doing the cool dice jewelry? That was a friends of uh, I'm sorry, friends of ours. And you're running, your um, but I. We we were we were basically helping them so we could also attend the same conventions. But um, I'd have to find out their information. I don't. I think they've updated some stuff, and I don't want to give out the wrong information. No, absolutely. I I remember you gave me a necklace with a cool D10 on it. I still have it. It's hanging up right over there on my board of memories. Uh, but my memory is. Oop, and that was two years ago. Two or two or three, two. two I or, think. I think no, it was two. three. It might three because pandemic time. Ah, yes. Thank you for reminding me. I just didn't. I couldn't remember if that was your company or not your company. But it wasn't no, your company. Nope. Just some friends. Oh, just some friends. Oh, how, we don't. We don't need to plug them. How close are you anyway? Uh Oh, that was a joke. Oh no. <laughs> oh. Oh God. It's I, complicated. I All right, let, let's just go. Let's kill something. Let's go. <laughs> oh, <Jimmy. laughs> He's like, that's enough chit chat. Time to kill a hoss. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, I mean, with that, uh, it's uh, far be it for me to not uh, not satisfy somebody's bloodlust. Um, yes, let's uh, let's get into it. Uh, I hope everybody's ready uh, because uh, we did all of the stuff ahead of time. Um, and these two, these two majestic beasts look fucking incredible. So let me just pull up the game here on my end, move a couple of things over, and then, uh, we shall, we shall do the grand reveal. Uh, whose game was it? Asks, did my rig resub not get through? Uh, oh, I may have missed it. No, I didn't. Hey, no, it, it went through. It absolutely went through. Uh, whose game was it? Z. Um, was it, like, geez, it's, was it's. Uh, subscribed uh, and has done so for six months. Thank you very, very much. Thank you very much for pointing that out. I'm sorry I missed it. Uh, just a couple, of, Matt, I'm just going to ask you to just sit on your bloodlust for just a second because we got to do content right. warnings for anybody that's new. Um, uh, uh, oh, I forgot what I was going to say. There was something else. Content warnings. Yeah, it was content warnings, but there was going to be, it was going to be, there was something else before that. No, oh, no, no, no. Uh, thank you to our mods. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Sarah Serende, one of our wonderful mods. Thank you for being here. Thank you for doing everything that you do. Uh, you were fantastic, and thanks for uh, actually coming back after a week off. Uh, yes. Anyway, so content warnings. Here. Bloodborne. This is a horror game. There is a lot of body horror. Uh, chat has been doing very, very good uh, about um, calling out content warnings, so keep an eye on chat. Folks will call things out. A um, couple of the rules of the road. Uh, I'm playing this game for the very first time. It's my very first FromSoft game. I'm trying to figure out all of the story uh, on my own. So if I ask a rhetorical question, that does not mean that I want an answer. It just I'm just talking to myself because I do that all the time, sometimes in the grocery store, and I scare other people uh, that are there with me. Um, but it does ensure that I get the good potatoes and the good produce. Um Yes. So this one in particular has a lot of body horror. It's like a horse mash with a person, and then eventually they wield a sword, and they're very sad. Um, and every time we ask them why the long face, and they never have a satisfactory answer for us. Um, also, uh, yeah, so no spoilers as far as uh, anything, you know, anything along those lines. If uh, I'm going to miss something, and you're like, oh, wait, there's a cool, like, thing somewhere, totally cool. You can call that out. If there's anything game-related you want to get my attention... Because chat, you're over here on my second screen. Camera's right here. Feel free to highlight at Isrid Games. Uh, Matt and Jason are going to be hanging out. Whether or not we beat the boss, they're going to be hanging out for the whole stream. Um, so yeah, uh, give the mod some love. Give yourself some love. Welcome back to the Isrid Games channel. Let's kill this fuck. 
Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Don't forget the uh, throat full of eyes. Oh yeah, yeah, the that the horse mouth. has. Yes, yes, it's got it's got an eye mouth. Yeah. It's huge goo. It's yeah. unpleasant. Yes. Uh, You've heard of I Max, and it's bad. <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, I need to step away for just a second uh, before I do the big reveal. I have to get more on my throat medicine because I've been, uh, uh, I've been doing a lot of VO directing recently and a lot of meetings, so my voice is shot. I'll be right back. I'll meet. Okay. Excellent. Good. Marvelous. Must. Drink. Goodness. Mm. Now, is that the famed throat goo? Oh, this is the Pepacoa. Yes. Um, I had to buy a fresh bottle because I've had at least at least a three-hour session um, doing VO direction um, and, uh, and things like that for a couple of projects, uh, or I've had meetings that have lasted about three hours, uh, every day for the past three weeks and I'm good. And I got a lot of vocal endurance. I am, I am, I am a, I am a pro, but that has, that has put me on my ass. <laughs> ah, That's excellent. Fair. Okay. So now no, that was the wrong button. That's the right button. I swear to God, I know how to drive this thing. All right. And here we go. The grand reveal. I'm now going to switch off of Jacob Cam and over into the game. A boop. Look at you. Sexy fucks. So on the screen, uh, we've got, uh, oh, somebody with a crown. Oh, that's very nice. Hey, ghost. Get out of our shot. Get out of our shot, ghost. These are good poses. You two look We're amazing. making contact. You two look absolutely incredible. It's because Ludwig's going to take this L. What the fuck? Like, Geely Sue, where did you find that? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just... <laughs> those claps weren't too piercing oh that was <laughs> that was real that was real bad jason <laughs> that's a good omen that's a good well, omen well done all right uh y'all ready sure I am ready. I am i'm ready for you two to work like a well-oiled machine and me to faff about so i think the only thing i want to mention is that your prime objective is to be is to stay not dead okay because if you die, we both go home. Oh, I don't want uh, that. There's also, there's also going to be the witch that comes from behind. Yep. Oh, but I don't... you also have to enter the fog first. So I'll uh, hang here. I don't forget that witch. Don't look back. He's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Everything's fine. Okay. Traverse the fog. All right, little witch. Hmm. Oh, he likes you. Yeah, he really does. Oh, I hate this one. I hate this attack. There we go. My job is to not die. Oh shit. Oh. Hey, good job. Is that second phase already? Phase two. It's phase two. You two are beasts. It's I did slain. take a beast blood pellet. Ooh. So 
I haven't done that. I still don't know what the hell those do. Right, we can't skip the cutscene. Uh, we can. Oh, I can. I don't need to see this. <laughs> it is a dope cutscene. It is. Oh. How's your enemy bullshit? Oh! Oh wait, it didn't skip the cutscene for me. Cut. Oh no! Uh oh, okay, we're good. I'm out. We're right. here. <laughs> okay. Note to self, if we have to do this again, watch the cutscene. If we have to do this again, he says. Behold, the pizza cutter. That is really good. Oh, uh, yep. Back. Oh, that's... It's fine. Take another one. Well... I'll get him. Okay. Got him. Nicely done. Well, that... That's fantastic. <laughs> very, very well done. Fuck that guy. I did my job. I didn't die. We've seen a man about a horse. <laughs> I am... Uh... <laughs> I was considering telling you it might not take too long, but <laughs> oh, I didn't want it. I didn't want it. I didn't want to jinx it. it. No. Nope. How did that feel? Uh, After so good. Three hours. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Fuck that guy. <laughs> yep. In particular, I feel like I feel like uh, uh, I feel like this was kind of like the eighty, like an eighties movie. And I was the like, the the kind of talented kid that just started at the dojo and was getting like bullied by the opposing dojo, uh, and then like <laughs> two two of the people came back from college, and just wrecked everybody in the opposing dojo. <laughs> like I didn't do shit, and I feel great about it. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta sweep the leg. Oh, mm. oh, ooh, ooh, it's a head. Yes. So I'm going to take a second and hop back on my computer. Yeah, sure, yeah. But... You can talk to the horse head? You can talk to the horse head. I'm going to talk to the horse put head. On, put on church stuff when you talk to the horse head. Oh, sure. Oh, yeah. Yep, that's like a thing. Like One father, second. Father Gaskins? I will... Yes, hold on. Uh... No. Not what I want. Because he is the one of the top members of the church. Yeah. Yep. The healing church. When you talk to. Da, 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 da. Okay, I'm going to talk now. Yes. Tell me, good hunter of the church. Um, and make sure you say yes to okay. so this first question. That is a relief to know I did not suffer such denigration for nothing. Thank you kindly. Now I may sleep in peace. Even in this darkest of nights, I see the moonlight. Huh. All right. Oh, holy moonlight sword. Yeah. <clears throat> Is that a thing I can equip? Uh, unfortunately not. It is, not. it is an arcane weapon. It requires a high I see. arcane stat. Huh. Okay, how's that? Is that better? Oh, I yeah. Uh, you could probably stand to be a little bit louder, um, Jason. Can actually probably <clears throat> microphone a little closer. Okay. 
That might be better. Yeah, that's great. So, well, that was, God, that was that was easy. I think I you have stats to equip that sword too. Do I? It's on how much arcane he has. You need fourteen arcane to do it. Nope. From what I understand, that sword is ten. for players who've been running arcane builds and getting shafted the whole game by no arcane weapons, and suddenly, hey, here's a giant arcane sword. No, I can't. And that's fine. I'm okay with it. It is I'm... very lovely to equip. Like, if, if you want at any point to just boost yourself up to the minimum to see its moveset and etc., it is, it is very cool, but otherwise, yeah. The big sword you have is is the big sword. So this ghost that I'm seeing here in online mode, are mm -hmm. these the hunters that are fighting each other, or is this somebody that's fighting the boss right now? It looks like it's somebody who's fighting the boss. Yep. Yep. Now, I do not have eyes on stream currently, so... Oh, yeah, let me, let me fix that. Right, burp, burp. you can share that. I can, I hope, and I shall. I just hopped on to stream. <clears throat> so you don't have that 10 second delay. Now, what the hell does this say? Holy Moon Light Sword. An arcane sword discovered long ago by Ludwig. When Blue Moonlight dances around the sword and it channels the abyssal cosmos, its great blade will hurl a shadowy light wave. The Holy Moonlight Sword is synonymous with Ludwig, the Holy Blade, but few have ever set eyes on the Great Blade, and whatever guidance it has to offer, it seems to be of a very private, elusive sort. That's cool. That's very cool. Boy, that's cool. All right, so I unlocked so, this. So, that yep. sword you're using right now is Ludwig's Holy Blade. Yeah. Used by hunters that weren't Ludwig modeled after the Moonlight Sword. Mm -hmm. Well, yes, that's cool as fuck. That's great. Oh my god, what design. Not what everybody is... can have a sword that becomes magic moonlight. Yeah, no, not everybody. And and nor should they. Oh, these little dudes have top hats. Should I exit the game and go back into offline mode? To that walk with me, you need to stay. But if you want to solo, oh no 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 no! I definitely, no no no! If you can like run around with me, that would be great. I'm yeah, gonna go boost some stats, and then I'll get back into the game, and we'll summon we'll summon Yi again. <clears throat> Hi, I'd like to spend some blood echoes. Very well. Let the echoes become your strength. I shall. Let me stand close. Now shut your eyes. Uh. Oh, I can't. I can't boost nothing. Huh. Too swole. I'm too swole, yeah. Farewell, good hunter. So yep. the good news is that there's uh, <clears throat> only three areas in the DLC, and that was one. Oh, well, great. <laughs> Underground Actually. corpse pile. Well, at least it's straightforward. I know where I'm going. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, that's how I know my throat's in bad shape. I'm clearing it a lot. Uh, Drink Weaver of Fated has subscribed and has done so for three months and says, let's get this boss. We did. We did. We got that boss good. Uh, so a lot of times in games, uh, one of my favorite classes to play, uh, like, you know, Diablo and, and mo most, most games are um, uh, summoning classes. If uh, it's got a turret or a minion or something where I can just like set it up and then I don't actually have to do much and I can just watch it go, I'm very happy. So for me, that was wildly satisfying. <laughs> I will take crashing my parents' desktop with uh, skeletons in Diablo 2 for 500. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I need to be of service. <laughs> 
Uh, don't awesome. forget to throw your regular armor back on. Oh, you know what? That's a good idea. Because uh, we cannot go without Tiny Hat. Uh, and, and why, can why you summon we? me in here? Yes, I can. Okay, yeah, thank let you. Just, let me get you. Um, you might actually have to get to the next lamp. I, I I looked at a let's play just before this, and apparently at the top of the stairs you should be able to. Yeah. It just has to like zone into the next area. Got it. Cranehurst. Aha. Yeah, that 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 fight is a big reason why I like the Whirly Gig Saw. That was real sick. Yeah, you can just awesome. hold like a button. Who's talking? What the fuck? Open door. I mean, I don't even have to. Because that... He's just thunking his head against the wall. Hold on. Do I want to open this door? There's no downside to doing so. Open the door. Ah, oh, fuck, it's locked. If you'd like to summon me here, you should be able to. Ah, excellent. Because I think I and see I, I think you down also there. have, um, I think you also have plenty of hard insight. Saw? Yeah. Whichever one is items. I am currently searching, and I can see on the stream that you are searching as well. There's definitely somebody down at the end of this fucking hall. Silhouette, ain't it? Yeah, you're not sneaking up on me, game. Fuck you. I'll bring friends. Shit. <laughs> I got fucking heavies to bring in. <laughs> servers will be quick oh yeah okay here it comes yeah yeah i knew it ah fucking saw you oh it's one of the uh, the oh neat okay he's got the uh <clears throat> what in the hell he's got a cannon yep okay there was some yep ah oh <laughs> oh no <laughs> all that in the boss fight. A blunderbuss. Yep. You would be I'm avenged. Sorry. Remember me. <laughs> do I need to summon you again? Uh, you do. You should be able to run around while it's summoning. I, I think it's still in the summoning mode, so I think if, if you ring just again? ring the small bell, it should. All right. By all means, do feel free to, to continue. Okay. Yeah, I hear it's still ringing. What is this place? Very good question. Okay. Why is there light in there? <clears throat> okay. You were praying. But you're dead. Fist of Grot. What the fuck? What is this place? This fuck. is my favorite hunter. Yeah, that <clears throat> is an offhand weapon. Oh, it's a weapon. Fist of... What in the fuck is this? Fist of, oh, they're just fucking brass knucks. Awesome. A chunk of iron fitted with finger holes. The hulking hunter woman, simple gratia, ever hopeless when handling hunter firearms, preferred to knock the lights out of bees with this hunk of iron, which incidentally caused heavy stag. Gratia was a fearsome hunter into onlookers. Her unrelenting pummeling appeared oddly heroic. 
No wonder this weapon letter assumed her name. That is cool. Well. Do, do, do. Do, 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 okay, do, 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 the one the with the light coming out of it? With the open door? With the open door? <clears throat> Here? Definitely sounds like one. Oh. She might be. Yep. I found her. Oh, very good. <clears throat> Does that happen when you have a bell? So when uh, you ring the beckoning bell uh -huh. it, and summon somebody, it actually summons a sinister bell woman. And what she'll do is until you kill her, there's a chance that the bell will also summon uh, people trying to invade you. Oh, that sucks. Oh, well, that's cool. But that sucks. <laughs> yeah, these games always have a, like, a penalty for trying to co-op. It's kind of miserable. Who am I talking to? Are you a hunter? Are you wearing an antler head? Yeah, you are. What toll? Do we hear the toll of the bell? Let me find out. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Wait. I don't think it matters what you say here. Uh, it doesn't change anything. But I think you Let's can hear the bell. answer how you'd like. <clears throat> I. He's got a bell. He does. Secrets better left alone. Well, I'm feeling pretty foolish tonight. It's fine. Stop. <clears throat> Jaded Cynic uh, just said it very well. Souls like games are rough, but ultimately fair, except for all the ways in which it isn't fair. All right, every side room. Everything. Okay, there's you had a fist. every ding dang corner. Every ding dang That's corner. Right. And I will follow your lead. <clears throat> okay, goop on the ground. Don't need to view them spectres. Oh, blind. Okay. Oh. Oh right, yeah, you're gonna want Vinny for this one because there's NPC hunters up here. I forgot about. Oh, wow. Oh, cool. They're hiding in the dark behind you. Cute. Are those fish? Are those fish men? What the fuck are you? Uh, are those fish men? Let's find out. Hi. Oh, that's a rat. There's glowy shit in here I want, so. Oh, okay, they die pretty easy, which makes me immediately suspicious. That one is hiding behind. Which you? Okay. Okay. All right, well, they were Cute. Cute. Ish. They sure. Got big old eyes. Yeah, yeah. Big eyes means cute. Big eyes means cute. That's what I've learned. Remind me to taught me anything. Remind me to post a picture of the uh, of a Dark Souls basilisk. Mm. <laughs> big eyes does not mean cute. <laughs> oh look, they're sleeping. Beware of yourself. Okay, great. Thank you. I, I would like to instead pick up this. To find that magic spot where you can grab uh -huh. it. Got it. There you go. 
Great One's Wisdom. Cool. So this here is... Okay, this is definitely like a Healy Church place, because you can see the... You can see the blood and the yeah. blood vials. Okay, so transfusion definitely happened here. Right? Right. Right. Yeah. And no. Oh, that's a person. Yep. All right, get ready. Yep. Yeah. She uses black sky eye and... Uh... Ow. Yeah, they set you up against a mage and a sword person to keep you distracted. Dead forever. I'm pretty sure if you kill them, they don't come back. That's right. Nice. Thank you. Mage, rush the mage. Where's the mage? Uh, she's here. Ah, they moved. Okay. Hello. Ow. That did a lot. Ah. Okay. So, how about we try that again? Agreed. <laughs> Side one of them's already dead. Yeah. I mean, now it's just now it's just going after the mage. Yeah, Icebox Blue said, or, "Ah, the snot okay. spell. It did look like they were just like doing a snot rocket." Mm -hmm. The the hunter tool, Hawk Lugie. Oh, beckoning. Oh, I have to get to the top of the stairs to use it, right? Yes. Okay. Ah, yes. <laughs> the legends of the old hunter. Hawk Loogie. Tracks too well. Wore armor of very sticky feathers. So you should be able to, once you've rung the bell, you should just be able to continue and it'll pull me in when it sees me. Hey. Hey. Ow. Give things. Okay, went down there already. Ah. There we go. Oh, do we need to try to find that, uh, the bell ringing lady, though? They respawn. Okay, so we have to find her. She's yes. She's not where she was before. Where is she? Is she? Oh, yep. She just spawned in. You got her? Yeah. Yeah. No PvP. Yeah, get her, Matt. <laughs> okay. Hello. Are you praying? You'd better be. Goodbye. Happy Hardly good time. knew you. Oh, neat. Okay. Oh, look That's at cool. this altar. 
you take a close look, there are a few features that might interest you. What the fuck? Why is there a beast under the... Oh, that's some cool symbolism. Oh, that's... Okay. So we've got a book, a bell... Somebody being ministered, but kind of... And then there's, like, one of the beasts under it. Almost like warning them of danger of blood ministration. Yeah? I mean, I feel like... Observation. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and there's a lever. That's nice. Okay. I assume I... Do I pull the lever, or do I put the... I think you put the thing... You, you put the thing the in? prompt at the altar. Okay. B, I think the lever is to call something back yeah. down. Insert eye pendant. Oh, in... Yep, okay, eyes on the inside. Oh, wow. Well, yep, here we go. Okay, off we go. Huh. So, real quick, yep. if you go back down after you light the lamp. Yep. Uh, and then send it back up, but don't go back up with it. Okay. Hee <laughs> hee. So, I assume operate device. Uh, either that, or you just walk onto it and then roll back off of it. <clears throat> oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? That's a big chair with a baby on it? Is that a... Is that a baby up there? Looking myself, I really know. Expect surgery altar. Okay, so this is Lo Lawrence's skull. Okay, great. What the fuck is this? It might be under key items. Lawrence's skull. Skull of Lawrence, first vicar of the healing church. Whoa. Skull of Lawrence, the first vicar of the healing church. In reality, he became the first cleric, cleric beast and his human skull only exists within the nightmare. The skull is a symbol of Lawrence's past and what he failed to protect. He is destined to seek his skull, but even if he found it, he could never restore his memories. Wow. Okay, so... Now, yeah. Sorry, go ahead. I have something for you to do after. Sure, yeah, I'm done. Go ahead. Um, if you hit the lever and then hop on the platform and ride it down, There are tertiary goodies. They went a little hog wild with the uh, design around here. I I should say so. It's all so pretty. They got the Raccoon City Police uh, Department guy on loan. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, church cannon? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, beautiful. Church cannon, an oversized weapon used by the healing church. A type of cannon that fires with a curved trajectory and creates an explosion on impact. Originally designed for use by brawny men with deteriorated brains, not, j not for just any ordinary hunter. But the men lacked the wits to effectively operate firearms, and the weapon was quietly ushered into permanent storage. That is very cool. 
I think I'm strong enough to equip that. I am not. It requires blood. Oh, you damage. need, yeah. Ah, okay. Most gun weapons, their damage is based off of the blood tinge stat. Ah, I see, I see. Can I just step back on this and it'll go up? It will not. Am okay. I am I activating it here? You might have to pull the lever. Yeah. Device is huh. not currently operable. Well, now Maybe there's a lever it, around the Oh, no, 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 you just step on it again. Okay. Is there a way? Did, did they go, like, super hog wild where I should have rolled off of this again to try to get beneath no. this one? Okay. Not this one. <laughs> Design that they obviously knew a percentage of the players would never see. It looks a little bit like a holy baby. Not like a baby I mean, with a hole. Babies are a theme. I, I've noticed that. I've definitely, that's definitely stuck out. <laughs> so Lawrence's skull can be used to do an optional thing. Okay. That is not necessary to do if you don't want to. Is it fun? It is a boss. Is it fun? Um, I think. Oh, I Can we inside. help him with that boss? I believe so. Now that Ludwig's dead? Um, that's a good question, actually. Yeah. The oh, answer oh, might be no. oh, somebody just fell from the sky. What? What in the hell? So... Yeah. Welcome to the research hall. Oh, that's not good. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, somebody's got somebody on his head. Oh, it looks like... Oh, no, it's not. He's not having a good time. That that person's not having a good time. Okay. Well. Oh, you got mushroom head. Uh, it's a good. Oh, you're you're talking. Has anyone seen my eyes? I'm I'm afraid I've dropped them in a puddle. Okay. I think I'll just leave you be. Okay. I assume it's gonna attack me if I step in the puddle. Uh, I don't think it will attack you. But, I mean, being suspicious of everything is reasonable. Uh -huh. Even the puddle itself, potentially. Yeah. If you take a quick step in the puddle, you'll see. Ah, uh, yep, poison. Okay, great. But that shiny is there. I'm out of... goodness. Hey! Blue Elixir hey. is actually very useful here. What's it do again? Makes still bodies undetectable. Oh, neat. Okay. Well, that, that seems fun. For the stealth thing. There's a stealthy part? No, you don't want there to be. The trick to this area is that it's a good amount of enemies that are that take a lot of hits, but you can also stealth by them pretty effectively. Give me things. Bloodstone chunk. Blood and with the two of us, it should be a lot less dangerous, hopefully. Unless I get shot again or something. There are <laughs> traps. Ooh. So. Yeah, watch okay. out. I, I will attempt to catch you, because I've been caught by a couple of those, and they will kill you. Mm. All right, here's more down. You want to try more down before we go more up? Let's try more down. I will follow your lead, and I will let you know if you're about to walk into something. Laboratory floor one. Does not open from this side. Okay, never mind. I'm just doing every ding-dang corner here. Make yep. sure I'm not missing a door or something. 
All right, well, classic Metroidvania, a bunch of doors, none of them open, one path to go, let's go. Oh, what the fuck? Where did you come from, you squidgy little thing? What the fuck are you? Those look like arms, suspiciously. Oh, it's bound. Oh, it's, it's, it's tied up and dragging itself along by its noggin. Are you coming for me? Nope, all right. Yeah, so we should kill these is what I'm picking up. Uh, yeah, sorry to interfere there. No, 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 it's not at all. safe to assume if it moves, it dies. I mean, no, because there was like an NPC. I was like, oh, I gotta get rid of it. And then, but did they walk around? But they had so many legs, so I assume so. You know what? I'm, that's not my fault. That's not my fault. They shouldn't have made it look like a monster if it didn't need to die. Oh, cool. There's no railing on one side. Great. Somebody call OSHA? <laughs> Great. <laughs> Be very careful around these bookshelves. Yeah. Oh, that that's will happen. One. Hmm. Oh, um, but because there are pressure so... plates yeah, on the floor. The level helped you there. Well, you know what? So noted. And there's no teacher like experience, is what so, I see. Yeah, you see, see. If you look closely here in front of this next bookshelf, there's ah, uh, yeah, there's a little raised platform there. Now, I'm not sure if they all are pressure pads. But cool. Let's. You see, some of them aren't. Oh, but that was definitely. Aren't. There we go. Some of them are. You are traveling with one untethered from the moors of time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the fuck's up with this shit? I don't like any of this. Is that a bad person? It's a bad person. All right, goodbye. All right. Okay. So they're just chilling out here, sticking, sticking. Oh goodness. Oh, gross. Sorry. Content warning. Medical related surgery stuff. Yeah. Right. This is about as graphic as it gets overtly, but obviously there's a lot implied. There's a lot of implications. I think the green door in that room you're in is might be uh, an elevator down. Yeah, back I won't to, be the able front, to manipulate the, the bottom floor. But it might also be go up, so. Oh, Actually, let's, let's try it. I was going to go down. Oh. I, I, I suspected that ladder down was uh, shortcut time. It, this be. place is like full of shortcuts. All right. I, I just looked behind me. Like physically looked behind me, and I was like, "Hey, Vinny, you there? <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> I'm here, bud. There we go. Just wanted to make sure in the elevator. I didn't want to do that, you know, douchey co-op thing where you're just like, okay, I take the <laughs> elevator now." Find us. Whoa. Now, the general rule is if you can target it with a lock on, it's hostile. If you can't, see if you can. Ah, I can't. Is that you, Lady Maria? No. You're someone else. How can you still talk? Your head's a. Not to put too fine a point on it, ma'am, but your head's a testicle. I can't make your head not a testicle. Brain fluid. Murky, mushy brain fluid. 
Okay. All right. Murky, mushy brain fluid. I'll... I'll find you some brain fluid, I guess. Is... Is any of this brain fluid, ma'am? Any of this? I'd love... I... Okay. Let's open this door. Hey, it's a shortcut. Okay. So, back up, and then down that ladder, I guess? Sure. All right. Which one? Is this another one? Oh. Not operable. Okay. There are layers to the shortcuts in here. Great. This is like big one column of an area with tons of shortcuts. Just there we go. All right. All right. All right. Oop. Oh, there's a. All right. Okay, you ready, Matt? All in your lead. All right. All right. Decorative old hunter garb. Decorative old hunter trousers. Huh. Densely designed area. So many little things Let's in the environment. See. Decorative Sorry, style. Gawking. Please gawk away. I'm looking up the lore. Decorative, where the fuck are you? I have so much shit. Where the fuck? Oh, is it not equipable? Oh, there it is. Okay. Decorative old hunter garb. Old hunter garb decorated with brass trinkets. At the time, some hunters believed that certain metals would ward off beast blood. On a night of the hunt, it is no wonder that people would resort to superstition. And the trousers are the same. Okay. So we came in from up there. All right, I guess it's out this door. There's a shiny down there. Let's get it. Mm -hmm. And watch out for traps at the same time. Yeah. I think usually they're in a diamond pattern of four. Very nice. The book shelves, especially. Oh, I can pick up blood, blood vials, too. Nice. Frenzy cold blood. Okay. There, we're going down this way. Fucking trap a do. Scares the shit out of me every time you step on one of the things. <laughs> Ooh, outside. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, cannot target. Uh, it's a... Is it tending a sunflower? Huh. What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay. Jason, do we need to do anything here? I'm finding that out now. I'm trying to remember the name of that NPC. Mm-hmm. Is it Willy? Splish. Oh, splash. Splish. splash. Oh. Okay. So theory time. This is called the Hunter's Nightmare, right? Yes. Okay. All right, 
So I think some of the old gods, or not old gods, great ones, sorry. Some of the great ones, they feel like almost, uh, because we found that one kind of in the basement, and they'd mentioned a couple of times that, like, some of them have ascended and some of them gotten left behind. Like, when they ascend, do they start to dream? And that's where we're at? But, like, different Great Ones have different dreams? But, like... Okay, that's... Hmm, fuck. That's as far as I've gotten. Because like, there's a bunch of dreams and nightmares and shit. So... What, what do we do about that? Because this is certainly not, like, on Earth, or wherever the fuck Yarnum is. So, for the description of the Eye of the Blood Drunk Hunter, um, I believe implies that this is, as not this is a this is a nightmare. Yeah. Where all the blood drunk hunters go. Okay. So, I think it might be best to view this as sort of a hell. Okay. Type. That feels situation. right. That feels right. All right. But this it does get definitively explained. Oh. Really? That's exciting. Mm -hmm. It to to the extent that anything anything gets really gets explained. definitively yeah. explained. Yeah. There is like a pretty clear this is what happened and why this exists. Neat. Hey. Oh. Well. Sky rats. Yeah, they definitely fell from a place up above. Something pooped a rat. Whoop, that's a, that's a, okay. Oh, thank you for stopping. I would have run right off. Fucking game. Piece of shit. Oh, what a piece of shit game. God damn. Oh, you... Dicks, what in the hell? Oh, that's really well designed, especially with the camera. Oh, you fucks. You oh, fucks. You're right. Oh, you absolute monsters. I'm sure they watch less plays, even five years later, and go, hee 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 hee. That was worth the 30 hours and five team members it took to get that just right. Am I hearing sobbing? It wouldn't be out of place. This place is horrible. Where the fuck do we go? This is it. I always kind of get lost. Uh, I think if you go back up the ladder and back out of that door, I think that leads to where you're supposed to go. All right. Let's give it a shot. Always with the caveat, if I remember correctly. Yes, of course. It's for navigation in these games. All right. So we're kind of back into the main hall here. All right. There's another... All right, can we talk to you? Lady Maria. Who the fuck Say is Lady Maria? I don't hear anything. Why? That's a million dollar question. The fuck? I don't remember a Maria in any of the item descriptions. Maybe I, but I'm not. It's, I mean, it's been weeks. I'll save you from going crazy. You haven't met her. Okay. All right, so we went down. Been mentioned. Yep, that's the stairs that we took. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Can't sneak on down there. No sneaky deekies. I don't think we go back down, do we? I'm not sure. Wait, yep. If we go back down, there's another staircase. 
leading up. Ah, Double marvelous. staircase. I also like the design of the lamps. Yeah. Ooh, that's a bunch yeah. of stuff. Careful of these enemies, they can dogpile. Okay. Let's not let them do that. Uh. All right. So let's. Okay. Let's explore out here first. Oh, there's somebody coming from the end of the hall. Oh, okay. Thanks, Benny. Anytime, Kringle. Got two more coming. Yeah. Don't have a lot of health, but they hit hard. Boy, do they. And there's a lot of them. Yeah. Oh, good. All that for blood vials. The blood vials that it took to get down there. Hey, look, I found a door. I miss that door almost every time I play this. Well done in spotting it. What the fuck? Oh, shit. I don't like that at all. You ready? I am. Oh, shit. Oh, that's a ghost. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, those are ghosts. Oh, I don't like this. I'm guilty. Okay. Oh. None of this is great. You may want to be careful going up that ladder. Okay. Like, go up it, but there are some enemies near it, I remember. Ah, uh, yes. Look at them. Uh, these ones are bad. I, I would be happy to go in first. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that guy. Yeah. <laughs> Fun. So they swing around their uh, IV stands. Cool. Content they warnings. Don't... Torture. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. Oh, did you done died? I, I may have, yeah. Okay, I hit the I'll bell again. Here's on real quick. Huh? Okay. Oh, there's another ladder over here. That's nice. Oh, there's enemies down there. That's not nice. All right. Do you have to ring the bell again, or? Uh, yes. And I'm, I'm not sure if we need to be in close proximity to one another. You do. Or we, yeah. You do need to be in close proximity. Okay, so cool. I need to get back to where you died. Uh, well, I warp back to the lamp actually. And I'm making my way up. 
a little bit, but the enemies are all in my zone. I see. Okay. Uh, so, not Cain nor Abel uh, has subscribed and has done so for 17 months. Thank you very much. Says sword man doing sword things. Indeed. So, should I get back to the lamp and then we run back here? Uh, if you want, yeah. I I will try to fight my way up close a bit of the distance. I'm currently at the base of the staircase. You know, the three staircase yeah. on a little alcove there. Yep. So, but if you go back to the lamp and if I use one of the uh, one of the items to go back to the lamp, all the enemies have respawned, right? They, the enemy shouldn't respawn if you use the item to go okay. back to the lamp. It's only when you sit at the lamp. Ah, yeah. Okay. So why don't I just use that item and we could run back here? Fair. To get you back into the game, right? Let's do it. Yeah. So head on back to the lamp and then we'll we'll get you back in. Yeah. Yeah. I I just want to take this opportunity to apologize to the internet for sucking at the game I love. <laughs> it is it is better to die in this game. Okay, maybe that sounds a little smug. <laughs> Dude, you you've been a huge huge help. A huge help. Imagine how it would go with three of us. Right? Yeah, I'm considering what I want to build like for next week or time. Is the bell currently... Oh, let me, let me hit it again. Ah, oh, there we are. Ah, I need to be reset. Okay, so my mine is currently also doing its little sonar boop. Oh, and that means we gotta find a bell lady, right? Not in every zone, I don't think. If it doesn't give us a message when we come in that there's okay. a bell lady, then we should be okay. Do I have to stay here with the bell? Here we go. I just discovered you. Oh, marvelous. Webby Webfoot has subscribed and has done so for 11 months. Thank you very much. I have back into the Vinny Fives. I'm back, good crinkle. Not the Vinny Twos. Not the Vinny Threes. Oh no, there's the enemies are back. Oh, they did respawn. And a bell ringing woman has appeared somewhere. Well, fucking duck. But, you know what we did? Well, now I feel bad for lying. Didn't we unlock a shortcut? Uh, yes. But I we should we find did. that bell person. I think we found them. We'll have to listen for it. Can I operate the device? I mean elevators with the gate. Uh -huh. No! No! Oh. Lag! Lag! I'll, I'll see if I can pull the switch and bring you right back up. Oh, please. Because you'd gotten stuck in the door because of lag and I couldn't get past you and then it shut and decided to go back down. Yeah, if we continue co-oping next week, I'll, I'll plug into the ethernet okay. and we'll hopefully jump less. I forgot mine wasn't hooked up to the ethernet either. That explains a lot. I am sorry. Oh, goodness. What? Oh, they got the park gun. I'm... I'm hearing Bill, but I don't know if that's... I think that's just that... to remind you that she's present. Okay. Oh, 
Oof. Nice shot. Ah, there. Found her. Ah, nice. They were kind. They didn't stick her in a corner on the seventh floor or something. <laughs> kind in big old quotation marks. Yeah. Just two floors up. So now we have to go down this. Oh. Oh, we missed the trap. So now down here, and then up the other one, and we should be back about where yeah. we were. Yeah, and big old wave of uh, yep. grabby hands. Oh. I find it funny that in every single FromSoft game, at least one type of enemy has that flailing attack pattern. Yeah. And I think more people die to that than anything else in any of these. Because it just stunlocks you. Like, if it gets you in the right way. And it's always on the weakest enemy. And it's just there to remind you that even the weakest enemy will kill you. All right. Right. Don't forget, big okay. guy is up here yep. too. Yeah. IV swinger. No, no, that's soul caliber. <laughs> I also do love me a soul caliber. Die again. I might have. I oh, will work no. my way. Yep. These enemies get me every time. So should they I hang out like here? A truck. Should I hang here? Um. I'll try to catch up to you. Would it be a better idea? I'll run back. Like, for the sake of the stream. I'm very sorry. Oof, no, no, don't, me. don't, no, don't. Come on, don't do that. Totally cool. Oh shit! <laughs> oh no! Well, you know what? Doesn't matter. I'm heading back to the lamp anyway. We're gonna pick you up. We're gonna do it all again. Don't even worry about it. It's cool. Yeah, I, I, I did that. I really did that intentionally. Like, I didn't want you to feel bad or anything. So, like, I'm going back to the... Don't even... It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Think nothing of it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I got I got killed by a couple of... We, we all die down things. here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just uh, refreshing my blood vials, and I'll yep. ring the bell when I get there. Yep, no problem. I am, uh, I ring you to bell. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, tell me, why do you like the FromSoft game so much while we're waiting for Vinny to come on back? I couldn't tell you. Okay. Um, <laughs> I, I'm utterly fascinated with how the, um, the, the, <laughs> like, the lore is presented, um... I, I watched the intro cinematic for Dark Souls 1, and I was just utterly captivated. It's like, this is such a cool world, and then they tell you nothing about it and make you find it out for yourself. Um, <laughs> and despite their issues, they always do generally feel like they're at least attempting to be fair. And okay. it's a very much a... You understand what happened that was wrong and you can fix it. Mm -hmm. I get that. I, I'm i totally fine with what happened to Ludwig because it feels like 
Ludwig, even after you learn everything and kind of figure out uh, it's kind of what, not necessarily what you did wrong, but a better approach, uh, Ludwig relied way too much on praying to R and Jesus to get the right combination mm. of attacks at the right time so that you survived and could win. His hitboxes are very like they need you to do a very specific thing and then don't tell you what it is and yeah. then that thing that they need you to do is like not easy to do mm -hmm. uh, like continue like repeatedly yeah i do like how the ghosts in online mode just kind of walk around mm. i'll be walking back and forth pacing uh many of them are as a matter of fact i looked on stream and i think i saw myself <laughs> There we go. Um, as more Dark Souls than this one, I, I just genuinely appreciate, um, at least in Dark Souls 1 and the other ones, they um, every weapon, even weapons in the same class, are a little bit different. So you can kind of... And no weapon is, in, like, completely terrible. Yeah. So there's no alt. Like, there's, there's good weapons, but there's no, hey, you win the game with Ultima Sword. It's like, okay. ah, yes, my plus 10 longsword is the most broken weapon in the game because it's just good. Mm -hmm. It it does seem geared more towards, like, personal style. I'm sure people have argued on the internet because, you know, that never happens. I'm just, you know, doing a supposition. Nobody argues on the internet. Um, uh, that you can play your own personal style or if you find a weapon that you really like, uh, you can make almost any weapon viable through it the whole throughout the whole game is what it feels right. like that's definitely the intent yeah. and um like people beat this game without leveling up people beat this game naked it's i mean it, like we can't see them what they do at home is totally on them and there's definitely yeah. streaming services out there for that's not what you mean you meant the character naked the character naked that's i knew that it's less important in this one because the the um, the armor doesn't really do a whole lot in this mm -hmm. one, but in Dark Souls, uh, you have what's called um, poise and equip load, and the higher your equip load is, the slower you roll, and there's eventually a ring you can get if you have a low enough equip load that lets you do cartwheels. I'm sorry, what? Okay, yeah. something has happened. Okay. I got sucked into another person's game somehow. Um, well, that's awkward. Yeah. Uh, I think you can press the silencing blank. I did. I just home. did when I realized that Christina wasn't actually where she appeared to be on the stream. <laughs> so sorry to whoever I just went into, quote unquote, help. Um, I'm spoken for. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Okay. Uh, uh, yes. Maybe you have to ring the bell again. I'm gonna ring the bell again. Actually, no. Oh, uh, if Christina. you can't, it means it's still going. Yep. All right. Um. Well, I tell you, if there's one thing I've noticed about Japanese developers and Japanese games, they always make multiplayer and matchmaking. It's just seamless. Seamless. This yeah, is especially. Yeah. This is based on my experience with, uh, you know, Japanese fighting games and things like that. Like, uh, especially with all the stuff that like Nintendo has done, it seems uh, unnecessarily convoluted sometimes. Elves of Zion just said, "Hey, now." <laughs> Sorry, Elves of Zion works in Nintendo. <laughs> I'm just glad uh, fighting games are getting good netcode. Yes. Yes. Uh, trying to I, find out how to do, like, uh, I'm playing uh, Guilty Gear right now mm -hmm, a little bit, mm -hmm. uh, and, and trying to play with a friend. They don't tell you uh, where the menu stuff is. Like the Lord. lobby, The lobby system in Guilty Gear Strive is atrocious, but the actual netcode is great, so it sucks. Yes. Because it is very hard to just play with a friend. Yep. Mm-hmm. 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 Yes. 
Naval Warfare just has more Strive netcode, less Strive lobby, please. Mmm, yes. yes. But didn't you want Habbo Hotel? I. What is that? It's, uh. Ooh. I guess an MMO from the early aughts. Very similar art style to the, uh. To the Strive lobbies. Oh, neat. Oh, that's very cool. I'll have to look that up. My, uh. Final Fantasy. Fort, or Final Fantasy XI. That was the. That was just a trial to get online and having to enter in like about a billion passwords for two different services, especially if you tried to play on uh, uh, Xbox. Oh, God. Ugh. Two, and I do remember the pain. Yeah. How are we coming there, Vinny? Uh, I mean, it's searching. It's blipping. Uh, I, what I can do is kind of follow where you are on the stream if you want to start clearing the level. All right. Um, maybe Let's I'll just flip in. Yeah. No, shortcut. Jacob, what are you doing? I have to ask, who have you been playing in Strive? Oh. Faust. Oh, love me a Faust. Oh, love me a Faust. Faust, in case you don't know, uh, out there, if you're not uh, fighting a person, Faust is a, uh, in Guilty Gear Strive, is a big, creepy doctor with a paper bag on the head. And it's great. And they're, they're, most of their attacks are uh, random. Their big thing is trying to confuse the other player while getting hits. They can give the other player a status effect. Yep. That uh, gives them an afro. Yep. And you can light the afro on fire. Yes, you can. Uh, and they're very tactical, too, because, like, they can throw out bombs and things like that. So if you can control the battlefield a little bit, um, uh, you can actually get somebody to, like, backdash into... Uh, so it's, it's, it's very much my style of play. Like, it's... Oh, God. Uh, I love Faust. I love Faust. Did not straightforward even a little bit. Aha! Go away! Yeah, I don't like making decisions in fighting games, so I just play Leo. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you don't need to make a damn decision. <laughs> Leo is the, uh, uh, the can, essentially, of, uh, Guilty Gear, right? He, uh, he has a lot of interesting stuff with his stance switches, but he's very much a, my plan is to get in your face yes. and confuse you, and then, and then you've died. And then, yeah. <laughs> And then hurt. I haven't, I haven't gotten a chance to play much of it. I'm not as well versed to say Tekken or Soul Calibur. And I only started playing fighting games again like a couple of months ago. It's hard when none of them have good online. Uh, the matchmaking though in, in Guilty Gear Strive, par excellence, I think. Mm. Whereas in Tekken, they're... Oh, yeah. I, I've, I've played matches where, from the first punch, I've just put the controller down because I know my character's not going to hit the ground again. It's always tough going back into, like, a fighting game that didn't just come out because the online is so mired in people who already know what they're doing. Yeah, yeah, and they're just, just shit killers. All right, so I should be in the room you're in, Jacob. Okay. At the bottom of this ladder. I'm just chilling. All right. So, I'm not sure if your bell is still going or. You may bell want to fire to the going. blank and then re up the bell. I'll f I, yeah, I'll do that. How do I do that? Uh, in your items, in your usable items, you have the silencing blank. Ah, uh, yes. I think that might actually also refund your... Oh. There we go. Alright, find the bell again. Did I? Oh no, I'm telling you I did. 
Yeah, for good measure, I did too. Like, I can cancel my own matchmaking. Mm -hmm. See, I'm trying to get Meredith to play Tekken with me. Tekken boggles my mind. I like Tekken a lot. <laughs> uh, they just Meredith put a Tekken in Smash. Go. They what? They just put a Tekken in Smash. They put Kazuya in Smash. Oh, yes, I saw that. Yes. They gave him all his moves. Yes. Uh, I saw the uh, the the trailer that they did where they made the announce for uh, Kazuya. Um, I the the trailer that that they did for Smash was amazing. Well, I see I see the ghost of I see several ghosts that, of of I think Matt. That was me. Yep. I'm here. It sees me. It does. It does. You are in fact here. I'm still trying to figure out what I'm, what I want to, what build I want to do next. Oh, this feels like sitting at a LAN party in Game. 2004, oh. and like the modem's connecting, and it says it's connecting. And you've been waiting for and 20 you minutes. Just, yeah, you just want to play in StarCraft, right? Yeah. Yeah. Like. Oh. Uh, Binako, uh has subscribed and has done so for seven months. Thank you. Uh, Coffee Brains, a first-time chatter, say they might be wearing uh, opposite faction covenant runes. Uh, we are not. Yeah, last yeah, I remember we, we you're, checked that already. Yeah, yeah. you're wearing but, a Radiance rune. Right, but good shout. That's a good shout. Yes, totally fair. Yep. Yeah, we've been doing it. It's just not cooperating. I'm gonna go kill that big guy. I'm tired of being Yeah, well, and feel free to go on. If, if this doesn't, if this kind of bugs out on us, I'm, I'm happy to just kind of backseat as well. Well, I'm just gonna keep trying here. Okay. Oh. Okay. 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 It might actually be easier if he's not teleporting all over the place. Oh. Goodness. Hi. Oh, you don't really stun, do you? Goodness, goodness. Okay, well, let's see what's down this ladder, shall we? Hi. Hello. You're all terrible. Oh, good. Good, they're just waiting on either side of the ladder, and there's five of them. That's... That's good. That's good. You know, I think that might actually be where all of those ones that come out of the door when you're on oh, the balcony you know come from. You're right. I think that is the case. So I'm going to skip it. Oh. At least they give you blood vials for the big dude. Yeah, that's very kind. Yeah, but definitely, definitely going to treat that as a uh, toy from the 90s and skip it. Oh, hello, door. What's up? What's what's in you? What's what's going on here? What sort of fresh dope? What? Nope, that was okay. All right, Jacob, chill. That was your own cape. <laughs> Fucking camera. Jesus. All right. Okay. Looking for traps. Here we go. Oh, that's that. This feels like a trap. Would you? Uh, I do not remember. Antidote. Okay.
Okay. Oh, good. Good, good. Oh, there's it. Yep, I saw you. Not sneaking up on me. You... Oh, yeah, that's, that's not what you're supposed to do. That's not. You have to just keep hitting down in order to do the thing. Hi. Okay. Well, that would be why they give you antidotes. Yeah, I see that. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's good. That's good. Ugh. Well, that sucked. I didn't like that. Yeah. How do you like it? Not so good, huh? Oh. Oh, what fresh hell is we have here? Oh, I can't. Immortal chair. Actually a plot important NPC. <laughs> they would. I wouldn't be surprised. From Sop totally would. Alright, that's okay. This is a platform above the Rootin' Tootin' Ivy Goopin'. Ooh, I'm a blood gem master. Isn't that nice? Alright. Okay. That... That's fun. That's uh, fun. I believe you can time it. And if oh, you, you run... found me. Oh! After all this time, you found me. Oh! Oh, thank goodness. I've been searching for you for so long. Hey, you want to run ahead and soak <laughs> all these bullets? <laughs> oh, happily. <laughs> Wait, you are now in the world of the Beckoner? Wait, well, that's a cool I title. Know. I'm putting that shit on my business cards. Uh, I might... Different person again? Uh, did I... You might have I'm to switch in... passwords. Well, I'm not in the Vile Blood Covenant. I don't have any of their runes. But I got pulled. Woo! Camera almost yeah, fucked me there. Yeah, I got pulled into another world. I That's think fun. the impurity one is all like the three of those are all covenant runes. Yeah, I've got the executioner one on. And that might guy that one. might be it. Yeah. No. Nope. Thought I saw the. Oh my lord. Okay, look. Goodbye. You're kidding. Are you kidding? He's just standing there. He's just he's Menacing. just chilling. Well, fuck. All right, fine. Oh, you don't have a head. What is up with that? You ain't got no noggin. No. Not good. Oh. Wait, there's more. No, there's less. They don't have a head. Okay, well, you can't ag him. Hello? I'm over here. Pfft. Is the next boss just gonna be everybody's heads mushed together? I don't want that. That one's got a trap on it. Yeah, I see that.
Ooh. That shelving unit must have had some bad tofu. Oh. Oh, it's goopy. What's goopy? What's moving in there all goopy? Uh. Goopy. Goo? Patient room floor five. Oh. What the fuck? Did they melt? What do you have to say? Fear your blindness. Great. This is a fine note. Oh, that's not great. That made people noises. Are they full of people? I don't people? remember if they can actually hurt you. Let's find out. Nope. Okay. Ah, oh, these are the heads. Ugh. 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 Oh, I, had, I got one. Would you like an oh. enlarged head? Oh, I picked it up, and now... Oh! I would not. Thank you. So when I picked up the enlarged head, they started moving at me. Hello. All right. Well, that's enough. That's enough of that. That's... Oof. I think of where that next shortcut is. Where's the enlarged head? I need that lore. Uh, it should be under equipment. Wait. Like, I can oh, put like, it like, on? Like, uh, yeah. You Dang. said that way too matter-of-factly there, bud. <laughs> You're like, yeah, of course. Yeah. I got three in my closet. You, what you the don't. fuck? <laughs> I thought you could put it on. Where is it? Yeah. There's too much crap here. Ah, there we are. An enlarged head of a patient of the cathedral with a cavity that just happens to fit a human head, although one would be mad to try it on. But if you do, listen carefully for the sticky sound. Drip drop, as water is seeping up from the depths slowly, steadily. All right. Great. All right. Well, that's that's where the missing heads were. Okay. All right. All right. This place is fucked up. All right. Okay. Uh, let's maybe not try that. I was like, I'll be able to roll. That'll be fine. All right, let's try this up direction. Uh-oh. I, I see. Hello. I mean, if I run from you, you're just gonna chase me. Oh! Ooh, that is some reach, boy. Oh, sure. There we go. Well done. <sighs> Those things kill me every other time I fight them. Because they don't stagger. They don't. Yeah. They don't stagger at all. Hey, it feels like I reached the top. 
I probably didn't. But it feels like it. And isn't that what counts? So, I think if you go to the floor where you found the enlarged head, the opposite side has the shortcut back down. Uh, right. Yeah, that might be worth activating. Yeah, that's definitely worth activating. And then I, we'll start if I'm reading right my maps. maps correctly. Yeah, we're definitely, we're definitely going to do that. Because I don't want to... I don't want to do any of this again. This is... This is unpleasant. It is a nightmare. I get it. I get that it's a nightmare. <laughs> so, it should be on oh, the opposite whoops. side of the floor you're on right now. Or... No, no, I think I have to go back the up and then one. down the other... Down the other staircase. Yeah. Yep. So that one right in front of you should have an elevator in it. I think. Hey, it does. Not currently operable. All right. Well, let's just. That way you don't have to go through everything. Yeah, that sounds real good. I like that. Thank you very much. Now, back up top. All right, now it's balance beam time. Do, 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 Well, this all seems awful. Oh, fuck. That's a good read. So, remember those rats earlier? Yeah. I do. Alright, you little fucks. previous games, the enemies would just careen themselves off of scaffolding. Oh, come on. Uh. Yep, there's a crow. Goodbye. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Crow. That was great. <laughs> I looked over just to see the crow go plop. This is terrible. Every single one of their games has at least one segment that's like this. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. There's always uh, a scaffolding section, a horrible poison bog, um, and a big castle. Uh, Icebox Blues brings up a good point. What about that brain fluid that... Uh... That one yeah, made. so one of the brain fluid things is up here. There's another one down where you, um Oh, I looked it up just beforehand. Oh good, it's uh, brain fluid. Oh, it's the shitty Castlevania part with all the Medusa heads. There's one at the highest point of the research hall. Um but you can't get to it quite yet. Okay. And then there's one in on the one of the middle platforms, uh, which you didn't go to. It has a hunter attached to it. Ah. All right. I don't think I want to twist this thing yet. Oh, I hate this. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Do not look down. Do not fucking look down. Ah, hello. Sit down. Thank you for the bloodstone chunks. Are you a bad person? 
No. Close. And you too will hear. I. That's cool. Ah, it's all right. All right. So, I'm probably going to have to go up and then come back down to twist around some platforms and stuff, right? Nope, I guess I'm just going to have to do that now. Okay. Hi. What are you fighting? <laughs> it always distresses me, or has been distressing me, I should say, uh, to see some of the ghosts fighting things where I did not encounter enemies. And I'm like, what's what's coming? Honestly, I forget that they're half the time at this point. The ghosts? It's like, oh yeah, just a guy running by. Thank you. Ooh. Hey, Sharkfist is raiding with a party of ten. Uh, Very nice. You may know Sharkfist from uh, Desert Bus for Hope. And a, uh, being a wonderful fiddle player, I believe... Uh, they run Alpha Flight this year. Is that right? No, 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 no. Bye. Nightwatch. Uh, so... What that call? You're looking okay. for... For the brain fluid thing? You're looking for, um... One of those enlarged heads? Yeah. I. But I it see won't one. be... Oh, yeah. I think that's the one. What were you saying? I think maybe I, uh... Uh... I think maybe I interrupted. No, I mean, you, you found it. Oh, okay, great. Oh, cool. It's talking. Great. All right. Ah, brain fluid. Oh, what? Uh, it got back up. It mm -hmm. didn't even notice. Uh, okay. All right, well, time to get going. Is that a door? Let's go find out if that's a door. Looks like a door and a ticket counter. Yes, hello. I'd like to buy one ticket off this ride. Thank you. Oh. What in the hell was that? What is that running down well, there? Well, that's horrible. Oh, what the... F What's going on down there? And can you it's climb It's uh, exercise hour. Okay. Yep. Look at it go. Ooh. That's a, that's a speedy lope. Yeah, we're just, uh, we'll just hang out. Hi! Whoop! Alright. Any more? What, el what else you got? Are we just... Um, on one of these middle sections, there's going to be a uh, an NPC hunter. Um, that would be where your second brain fluid thing is. Fun. Um, yeah. Currently fighting that hunter. Just dive. Oh, magic pixel bullshit. Uh. Uh. Fucking crows. Any more crows up? No? Good. It sounded like one of you just shut a car door. That would 
pretty impressive. Or a microwave door. And it scared the fuck out of me. Because I thought hey, it man. was like a crow coming down. <laughs> I will I will let my wife know that No, 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 no. Don't you worry about that. No, no, she will laugh. Okay. She will absolutely laugh. Am I going back to somewhere I was? Wait, what the fuck? Wait. I think it's one of those cases where you have to go back down to go up. Yeah, I get this. Uh, but it feels like this is where... How did those things die? I didn't kill them. Did I? Machine gun? I think the machine gun guy does shoot at those. Oh. Oh, I mean, there's a... Okay, no, I guess I haven't been this way. There's stuff I haven't picked up and things I haven't killed. I think what raising it did was connect a bunch of the staircases that ah, weren't connected. Ah, thank you. That makes good sense. Yeah. Oh, shit. Hey, I found that hunter you were mentioning. Yeah. That would be the one. Yikes. Oh, they got poison knives, too. <sighs> well, let's go give that brain fluid in. You know, now that we're back. Sound good? Sure. Yeah. Just um, die if you want to pop the bell. Where the hell did this guy come from? Oh, yeah. Oh, hello. Not what the fuck? Not a sight, is it? The true face of the blood-worshipping, beast-purging, healing church. But that's not all. You seek the secrets held by the nightmare, do you not? I mean, kind of, yeah. Yeah. Then here's what you must do. I'm all ears. Find the astral clock tower and kill Maria. She hides the real secret. Her name is actually Amy. All right, you know what? I think that's all the time we have for tonight. That's that's all I got in me. This place is fucked up. But you two, but you two, let me say how much I appreciate and love the both of you for coming in and helping me kill that boss. And for hanging out. So, uh, Zero to Hero and Finny Fives, a huge, huge amount of gratitude. Thank you very much, chat. If you could uh, give our fine, fine community members and wonderful guides uh, uh, a huge, huge round of applause and a thank you, that would be greatly appreciated. You two are fantastic. Thanks for showing up for this, really. Thank you for having me. Yep. Yeah, it was a pleasure. Yeah. Uh, so if uh, if somebody uh, enjoyed enjoyed your stylings and wanted to find you on the internet, uh, do you have anything that you'd like to plug? Or um, apparently motorcycle I'm outside. But yes, please go ahead, uh, Jason. Why don't you start this time? Because Matt started last time. Uh, I'm over on Twitter at, at I am no Lionheart. I do graphic design and other work, freelance work. Awesome. All right, Matt. You can just catch me, Vinny Fives, over on the Discord if you're there. I don't really have anything to plug, but uh, yeah, it's, it's been a pleasure to be here. Yeah, thanks a lot for being here. Uh, and speaking of the Discord, that's discord.gg backslash Discord Games. A huge thank you to our mods. Uh, if you haven't, throw us a follow. Uh, we'll see you around the Discord. Uh, you can check us out and what we're about as a publishing company, a video game publishing company, at usbird.net. We like video games. We like you. We like you liking video games. Uh, and we've got a couple of sales going on. You can check those out on Steam. The Steam Summer Sale runs until the 8th uh, at 10 a.m. All of our 
or a, a lot of our games are actually on sale. Or uh, you can check out uh, Valhalla, which is on sale in the Humble Bundle uh, DRM free for 33% off, and you can get a bunch of games uh, on that. So thank you very much for being here. As always, uh, we're going to be back this Thursday for a special stream. Uh, keep an eye on our social media at usbird.net on Twitter and uh, Facebook if you got it, uh, or our Discord. We uh, always put our announcements and sales there. Um, we got a special stream coming up this Thursday, so uh, I hope you're hope you're ready for that. We're gonna have uh, we're gonna have a good time and probably some more guests. Uh, so keep an eye out tomorrow for details in that announcement. So as always. Take care of yourself. Take care of others. Keep your spirits up. Uh, Vinny Fives and Zero to Hero, thank you so, so much for being here. Thank you, Jake. Awesome. All right. Thank you. All right. Good night, chat. And we'll see you uh, We'll see you Thursday, 5 p.m. right here on the Esprit Games channel. Bye. <laughs>